Hello, everybody! I am Moldy Worst, and this is Okami once again. And now, I guess I gotta look at this thing. Wow, check out that wall painting. It said that a crystal sphere that makes the tree grow is enshrined somewhere around here. Based on this painting here, I'd say the rumor must be true. Still, something's not right. Don't you think something's missing from this painting? Yes, I think it can use a little one of these. There we go. That ain't quite what I wanted. But still, that poorly drawn dick actually formed a sun. What in heaven's name? How did that happen? Well, now I can go hide. Er, I mean, now I can go train. Yeah, you keep telling yourself that, Susano! And I'm gonna come and cut this rock in half real quick, because I can! No, I can't! Now I'm gonna go into this dirty-ass water. Probably shouldn't do that. It's all nasty and gross, and it slows me down. Okay, let's try that again, and there we go. I remember how to jump up the wall. Ew, a plant! So it wiggles. Wiggle plant! Water. What a strange place. Really the secret trading ground that Susano mentioned. Speaking of which, where'd Pop go anyway? He probably got ate by that plant. Plants have a tendency of doing things like that. And I'm more interested in this thing. Perhaps I can find a way to let the water flow out. Tiny sapling, a smell of faint scent of sequoias coming from this sapling. <sighs> maybe if I cut this thing, maybe if I cut the plant, ha ha! Nothing happened. Herm. What's up with this puddle? Looks pretty chintzy for what's supposed to be a grand altar. But there needs to be something on here. So, if I were to not do that, stand here and draw. Hmm. Stand here and draw something. I don't even know what it is, and I'm not trying to do a dick this time. Oh, here. So... What is missing from here? Does... No? Hmm, maybe I need a wider coverage. There we go. That should do it. No, it shouldn't. Slice the waterfall. No, God damn it! I see. That's why there's an altar here. For worship at the sun that shines up there in the valley. Okay. So I just need the sun, which means do 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 do. There, it's a cowboy hat and not a dick at all. And now the sun shines. Huh? I bet something would happen if we could get this right. Yes, right. I know this room's had some kind of secret. Okay, so I didn't draw the sun good enough. There. A big ass circle. Now it doing it. No, that's not doing it. What if I do it here? No. Boop. <coughs> I think I noticed something here. This rock seems to be missing a piece. What if I were to just do that? <coughs> no. That is not the case. And here we go. Now we put the sun up there. So, does that do it now that I did it somewhere else? No. 
Okay. Kinda stumped on this one. I mean, that wall painting had a huge, magnificent tree on it. Sun shines on a thing that shines on the sapling, so... Maybe the monster's evil is keeping its power at bay. Where did this come from? This weird-ass sign. Signs just don't appear like that. Sacred cher tree cherry cascade. Haven't seen anything remotely like a sacred tree around here. Except maybe that sapling that will be a sacred tree. Ah, here we go. I found the way. The way has been found. The way has been found. And there's a mirror. Eh. Just a savey thing, though. And why did you come off of it? Okay, so there's Susano. And why you tell me about a thing in my inventory? Rawr. What now? You, you foul beast, how did you get in here? Foul beast? Uh, that is a bear. <laughs> it's got a leaf on its head and it's falling asleep. Who have some nerve sneaking into my private training ground? Now you shall get a taste of my new secret technique. You, your foul beast looks like an ordinary sleepy bear to me, pops. Enough talk, my blade thirsts for battle. Here goes another, Susano style. Susano! Su. Oh, okay. I didn't do the thing. Let's try that again. Exploding implosion. Susano style. Susano! Su. Cut you. Sa. And. No! Slice! There we go. Susano! Quit shouting your own name, you egomaniac! No, for Susano style! Exploding implosion! And. There we go. Pop! That'll teach you, you foolish beast. You're no match for my new secret technique. So it's just asleep again. Thought it would be kind of mad at him. Cough, cough. Um, uh, rest in peace, foul beast. The great warrior Susano condemns the offense, not the offender. Anyway, there are other monsters I must deal with. <laughs> Just give him that little puppy head tilt. Not quite sure what he's doing. So, bear. Sheesh, it's just David. Like a, well, a bear. What a snore. Makes Susano sound like a kitten's purr. I bounce on your belly. If I can. Eh. Nope, overshot it. Come on. Can't bounce on him. This crystal sphere is filled with thieves. This is very used for a good harvest ritual or something. Hey, that will be blah blah blah. I know. I gotta go push it and put it in that puddle. Yeah, I get the idea. Come on. Shut up and let me push. Boosh. Not that way. This way. Good to see that it doesn't have too much physics behind it. That would be a pain in the arse, trying to physics my way through this. Eh. So I can't launch it further. Okay, F weird ass physics. Don't fail me now, you are failing me now. Exactly what I requested you didn't do. Doink, doink, into the puddle with you. Kirk Chunk. So we got a tree. Hey, is this a guardian sapling? It's all withered like the others. So? But the who turned out the lights? Oh, it's another constellation. Yay! Now let's constellation this shit all up in the constellation hole. Now, which one's missing? Okay. 
So I kerploop there and there. It looks like a banana. Okay, so we got the banana constellation. Which turns out to be a yeti who dances with some weird thing. Sakagami. Oh, Amaterasu, origin of all that is good and mother to us all. My gratitude for releasing my body from its slumber. Please accept my humble thanks in return for your great kindness. I am Sakagami, one of the true. Tri. Triumvirate of the floor. Of flora gods known as the Hanagami, my brethren, and I have been entrusted with the brush techniques known collectively as Green Sprout. I now grant my humble power to you, use it wisely. Okie dokie then. New power for me. So. Yeah, that was Sakagami and the blah blah blah. Let me do the thing. Yeah, barely the blue blood dig big big flap blah 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 the blood draw a circle on the way to Hey, it'll make the winter guardian zapping blossom too. Good. So circle on the twee and throw in a little dickishness there because why not? Quit falling around. Just draw a circle on the winter guardian zapping. Fine. Cur done. There's your circle. Okay. I said just draw a circle on the Wither Guardian Zapling. They go flower and full bloom, we draw a circle. So. Uh, here. A big old circle around the whole thing. No good. Okay, I just keep making the sun. I bet a big tree requires a big circle, so okay. So the circle should probably encompass all of the branches, am I right? No good. Okay, so he's just showing me what to do there. Big circle. Around thing. Okay. So, yeah. I just... It had the circle too high. There we go. That worked. Nice clean water and everything. Everyone was happy. Except for the people that are still in the cursed places. Yeah. Give me that praise. Give it all to me. I need me that praise. Yeah, everything grew back so quick. So Kui was getting about the power to get his blink and zoom. This is what Hanabani is supposed to look like. Seems that Kui is going to zap as if the evil curse. I'm not sure how weak the gods have become recently, but it must have taken some wickedly strong power to suppress this magnificent guardian assembly. Even if you are Shiri Anu reborn, then we might be able to get more than we bargained for. Yeah, let's just. Yeah, let's go. I know, I can revive the thing. Just stop talking. I don't care. Shut up. Let me go. Oh, yay. Monsters. Just what I wanted for Christmas. And I'm gonna slice you. Bam. You got sliced. And you are looking in the wrong direction, idiot. Slice. Ha. You got sliced. You got sliced real good. Now... Okay, so why is there green stuff coming out of my brush now? That's not normal. I cut you in half, I like cutting my enemies. Wait, alright, now he turns black and white. That just put ink on him. So... Now if only that had killed him like I wanted it to... Instead, it just got him all inky because I didn't draw a straight line. Okay, so now we got boars. And it's got little boar babies. Heh. <laughs> boars. They like to charge at people. 
feed. Fresh fish. Arrows. Yeah. It looks like this food has spurred no interest. I didn't think so. So I can bite you. I bite your ass. Heh. <laughs> Suck it, boar. How you like wolf fang in your ass. Okay, so the tree's still here. Maybe we could hit it through right back at it. And yeah, I know. Okay, so bloom this motherfucker once I deflect his attack. Bam! And now you are stunned and bada bloom, bitch. Now you are a normal tree who won't try to murder me anymore. Yes, that works. What about this statue? All dirty, but that's proof that it's been watching over us for ages. So yeah, enjoy your dirty statue. Oh yay, more evil. How bad we to be to be bad to be bad grass. You pound blue, fill up your brush, and the bloom will take care of the rest. So yeah, bloomy bloom bloom. I don't think it worked. So if I were to just there we go. Now it's aimed correctly. There we go. No more death and... Ooh, it's a weird-ass two-dimensional object. So can I have it? A uh, green sprout tips. Okay. Poke holes in the ground with the... with dots. The ink becomes a seed and trees sprout forth, confounding foes. The life force of the life force of this vegetation is the bane of evil. So I can just do that anywhere. Yeah, I get the idea. Shut up, it's soon. I wanna try the thing it just told me. So doink, doink, doink. Ha! I made trees! Cool. Oh, hello, evil tree. And suck on your own fruit, please. And now you go all stupid, and then I can turn you into a normal tree, like so. Become a tree and enjoy it. And now, for being such a dick, I cut you down. Ha! Die, asshole. Die. Oh shit, I'm out of time. I gotta end this episode. Not sure what I'm gonna be doing in the next one. Probably reviving that big old tree out there like I'm supposed to. But for now, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed watching. I hope to see you again in the next one. Bye!